What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moodle WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to reverse columns order into mobile or tablet navigation using Elementor WordPress free plugin, the page builder from Elementor in the free version, okay? So first of all, let me explain and show you some page with this error and some example of the usage of this feature. Reverse columns is something like normal into the design. We load from right to le uh, from left to right and from top to bottom. So into this page, if I go to mobile, get 10% discount, came first, and after this, this flower image. If the image is into a new co into the second column. So into the first column, we have the get discount while mobile. And once the image is into the second column, into the right side column, the image comes after it. Exactly the same into these icons, for example. Let me show you again. Here is the icons. The R products, the R shop, and the save day delivery, the same day delivery they came into the into the order so from the left to right from the left to right however there is cases that we need to apply some image into the left and the content into the right however if we try to load it let me show you another example if we try to load it into mobile, into desktop, it's all right, okay? But let's try to load it into mobile. And here is the result we got. As you can see, it's, it isn't nice, the image cutting down and the text around it, but into the same section, it does not look beautiful. But there is a way to fix it. But luckily for us, into those cases, we have an option using Elementor WordPress Page Builder plugin to change how those columns are loaded, the order of the elements. We can make the text we deliver today came before the right as came before the content into the left side. So came before this flower into this example. And how to do this? First of all, uh, you are using Elementor, so you can click right here into edit with Elementor in the top of your page. Okay, edit with Elementor. Click on it. We're gonna be loading the page back end with options to edit. And first of all, we need to be able to see how this section looks into mobile. So into the corner, the bottom corner, left side, right here at the bottom, we can see the responsive mode, okay? Next to this, I, this A icon, we're gonna click on it and an option to change into the top of your page games. So I'm gonna change from desktop to mobile right here. And here is the page and how it looks like on mobile. So we're gonna need to edit some parts of it, of course. And how to do? First, we're gonna select the section, okay? So edit section, hover your mouse over this, click and edit section. After this, we're gonna have a look into our left side of options, our editor menu, and into the left side options, we're gonna click on Advanced, okay? We're gonna scroll down a little bit, and we have some options like here. The options from sizing, the motion, the attributes, the custom CSS, but we are looking for responsive, okay? So click on responsive, and this is the trick, okay? We can hide this element on mobile in the case that we want, but we do not want to hide. We want to that be a person see the top of our page. So this is not a solution, but maybe on your case, the solutions changes according to the cases that you have, okay? But let's go. We want to reverse columns into mobile. And here is the result we got. Now the order of loading in mobile changes. Now it's loading the right column before loading the left column. So this is the result we have. 
simple, fast, easy, and really, really effective. However, let me share with you some extra tip, okay? As you can see, there's too much space before the content starts, and we can change it as well right here into the advanced tab. We can reduce the We can reduce the padding top. Just click into this element. For example, in this case, it's not gonna be in your section, gonna be right here into the edit heading. And once, once on heading, let me disclose this. And for the top, instead of the default um, 100 pixels, I'm gonna change, for example, to 33. 43. So after clicking on to the heading while clicking right here, we're gonna see this option for paddings. I'm gonna unmark this option, okay? Link value together because we just want to apply a padding to the top, not to all the sides. And I'm gonna type something like 70, for example. And here is the result we got. We previously have some not nice looking section onto our mobile and just reversing columns order on loading. We did change it and we could change the spacing specifically for mobile loading. This is easy, fast, effective and is present on your Elementor free version. So easy peasy. Now let's review how does it looks on tablet. Here is how does it looks on tablet. It's okay for me, I see no problem at all. I just prefer to change how the section looks, the sizing, I'm gonna apply something like 80 for example, and into desktop, it's alright. And it is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmodo.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. Also download our Enzo free WordPress theme on wordpress.org and download our borderless WordPress plugin. That is also apply some extra elements and widgets for Elementor plugin for free all in wordpress.org. Some extra tip. We could also click into this section and, hit and change to reverse columns this section as well. This changes according to your needs, but in the case that you want, you can reverse any section of your site. This is really useful in the case that you are using an RTL website, uh, right to left, for example. But this is some topic for another video. If I bring you some value with this video, please subscribe to this channel, like the video, leave a comment right here, share with your friends, it's all free and you may help someone, okay? And don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook, we are Visual Moto there, we bring some value there as well, we share our blog tutorials about lots of topics and WordPress especially, okay? But website creation, design, marketing, sales, okay? We, I'm gonna leave a link into the first comment of this video with very useful things, okay? So I'm gonna leave a comment with very useful links. For example, a place where and you can purchase a domain name for 99 cents, a place when you can download free design assets like fonts, templates, image, Photoshop templates, and they update it every week, so you can download new things every week and all for free. And a link where you can purchase a hosting and a VPN in a very, very cheap price. It's a fresh, special offer, okay? I also gonna leave some useful links to related videos into the comment description. Review this. And leave a comment, don't forget to leave a comment in the case that you have any question, I'm gonna be happy and talk to you and help you as well. And I see you later, all the best!